off to a local club trial today. Quite excited, not ridden a club trial in, uh, in a little while actually. Not even ridden a bike for a while. But we're back and it's new bike day as well. Just picked up my new TRS which I'll be on for the rest of this year. Uh, I haven't actually had time to ride it though so I'm going to be running in the bike today so I'll talk to you a bit about how I'm going to be doing that and um, hopefully get some good footage as well for the event. Good local grassroots trial today, nothing big but perfect uh, type of event to run the bike in and just have some fun. See you in there. Tall bits. There we go. Thank you. Welcome. Cheers. Which one? Left up one. Yeah. Just to speed it up a bit. Yeah. So you mean I was just going to wait until I bedded it. Quite solid on the front. Because they are a bit different than the the alley ones. Yeah. I can't even ride mine like that. I've got to have it almost out. No preload hardly at all. section five just down here You don't get your feet wet, you're not at a trial. I'll do it just for you. <laughs> ride it is slippery Adjusted the clutch 
and the braking point and set my hand above position. The clutch is, now it's starting to bed in, I need to actually adjust the clutch slightly uh, to get it to my preferred biting point. But that's the thing with new bikes, you do need to give it a little bit of time to bed in before you start doing too many adjustments. Suspension is starting to bed in now, it's still a bit slow but that will speed up as it beds in. So I'm not going to do anything to that. Yeah, doing good so far. I, very, I, I moved last weekend to Stroud, but before I literally did 15 minutes of it. So it would have been my local. Do you prefer that or your electric boat? Um, I prefer this, but yesterday I, I, uh, I was riding it extremely well on my electric. Yeah. It was like step subs this big and then... So you, you quite like it for a bit of fun? Yeah, we're doing wheelies and jumps. You could do wheelies on that, can't you? Was one of the young up and coming riders in the Wessex Centre, one of the Maslins. This is also his practice ground, and uh, he's looking real smooth today. I think I'm gonna have to be on my A game to make sure he doesn't do this. I'm struggling with this section. There's a bit of a field crossing, so it's good to go all through the gearbox, get some air in the system, get some air through the bike, give it a good blowout. Nothing too aggressive, I'm only kind of quarter half throttle, but uh, I'm about to go into 
quite a long queue now, which is great. Gives the bike a chance to cool down a little bit before uh, start riding with them. Did a bolt check on my third lap and I'm just about to start my last lap now. So we're back from the trial, time to wash it off, give it a bit of an inspection and do a few final checks now it's been run in. So just checking the spokes because they can come loose as the bike's bedding in and the wheels are getting knocked for the first few times. So just check them front and rear. Just always best to check disc bolts and the sprocket bolts. All's good here. You can never be too careful so it's always good to check these. And then bolt check. So that was my checks for first ride on the bike. I'm not sure if I said before, but I only got the bike on Wednesday, prepped it and PDI'd it that day. I was able to ride it around outside the shop just to try and get some heat cycles into the bike to let the bike get nice and hot and then go cold. And that just helps the bedding in of the engine. Perfect trial for it. A couple of short bursts of uh, big revs and dropping the clutch on a few items, on a few steps, but no real big flat out for any long periods of time which is something you really kind of want to avoid the first time, couple of times you ride the bike. Luckily, I didn't have any loose bolts or spokes from today. That is something I'll be checking on a regular basis, especially when the bike's new. It's not a bad idea to do that after every event, to be fair, though. Hope you enjoyed this video, and we'll see you again soon.